So you just moved out of them. They sold you a non-residence when you live in Alabama. Oh my God. Oh, oh, it's, a big oh it's a big smallie. It's a yes. It's a big <laughs> just call me the large mouth master. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a smallie. It's a smallie. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Check that out right there. I finally decided to make the big decision and buy a big, nice bass boat. Hey, get away from my boat. <laughs> oh, hey, hey, oh, hey, hey, hey sorry, hey. sorry, sorry. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. I did not buy a bass boat. I have a wife and two children, so I do not need any more responsibility in my life. But if you look very closely at the boat and you listen to the voice that you're hearing, you might know who owns it. That man right there, Mr. Mikey Balls. Welcome back to the channel, Mikey. What's up, Lojo? Me and him have gone fishing before, if you guys remember last summer. But if you're new to the channel, you may not know who this guy is. He's actually an O. G on YouTube, one of the first fishing YouTubers. He's been catching big fish on camera for a long time. So make sure you guys go check him out after you watch this video. I'll put a link right in the description to his channel. We are at beautiful Lake Gunnersville right there. And a very busy boat ramp, by the way. So, so maybe that's a good sign. Maybe there's some good fish out here to be caught today. But Lake Gunnersville is just one of those places. It's a mystical place. I mean, it's one of those big bass destinations. Everybody knows about it. It's like Lake Okeechobee, Florida, Clear Lake, you know, California, Lake Fort, Texas. It just has that kind of mystique around it. But that's not what I want to talk to you guys about today. I actually want to share yesterday's video from me and Mr. Mikey Ball. So we had this great idea, right? <laughs> like, hey, we're going to go to Pickwick Lake in Alabama. Because Pickwick, if you guys are not familiar with it, is known for two things. Nice largemouth bass fishing and big smallmouth bass fishing as well. It's one of those lakes that has both in big sizes. And as you guys know, I have never caught a smallmouth. So Mikey took it upon himself to say, you know what, Lojo, I'm going to put you on your first smallmouth. Well, let me tell you something. Big smallmouth were caught yesterday. Big largemouth were caught yesterday. Game wardens were involved, right? <laughs> and uh, yeah, so it, overall, it was a crazy time, guys. Enjoy this video, and I will talk to you guys at the end. Thought I had something nibble on me for a second. I'm just feeling a ton of stuff. Yeah, I do. There he is. Yep. Be a smallie. Be a smallie. It's a little large bill. Yeah. And the day begins. A little fat joker though. Oh, gotta let, let, gotta let my man lick it over here. Go ahead, get your lick. Yeah, there we go. That's going to be the tradition is let him that's lick the fish. Look at that fat fish there, dude. How fat that little joker is. Oh, sorry, buddy. Slapped you with some chartreuse. Why is he bleeding? He wasn't even hooked that good. All right, little fat largemouth. You are not who we're after over here. But old Mikey felt a little rock pile out here straight ahead of us and uh, instructed me to cast at it. And I did. So a little slim shake worm doing some work. We also dipped the tail. He said the chartreuse little dye stuff has been working for him. So I dipped the tail. It's kind of created like this aqua green, like really cool looking little worm. Cool deal. That was such a subtle bite. I'm, I'm over here talking to Mikey off camera. I'm like, well, I'm feeling the rocks, but then again, I don't know if this is a bite or not. So let's just swing. And if it's not a fish, we'll cut it out of the video. Just about yanked the rod out of my hand. Oh. Bro, go oh, ahead, yeah, man, get in there. Just missed one, guys. Dude, that was such a hard, like, you know, I'm dragging it this way and it's like a boom, but he probably, I probably yanked it out of his own mouth because it was on taut line, you know, and I wasn't ready for it. Dude, I'm so like, like nerve wracking, you know, like, oh man, like any bite could be a small way, but I just don't know. Well, Mikey's on over here. Hey, look at that. That was a little largey. Man, we're just freaking smoking the lunkers over here, aren't we? Jeez, man, we're working on about a pound right now. <laughs> we're getting things going, man. Dang, I just got thumped. What the heck? Oh, Largy. Get him, Mikey. I just got thumped in the same spot you did. Get him. You got to let Goose lick him. It's tradition. <laughs> Okay, so we found the largies. We've come to the smallmouth lake and we found the largies. So, all right. 
We talked about this, guys, as we were getting ready to do this. We're like, you watch, we're gonna catch nothing but largemouth. But don't you worry, we got a good feeling about today. We just started here, so we're, we're okay. It's still early. Oh my God. Dude, I just set the hook on the biggest log fish in the lake. God, whoa, that's not cool. Oh no, I got it. All right, Mikey's back there retying because he just got snagged and broke off. I just, I know y'all heard that hook set. It felt like a bite, you know, sometimes, sometimes those trees bite back. That one? Uh-uh. Oh, that's a little, another largey. Mike, Mikey largey balls. That's what I'm taking, that's what I'm talking about. This is why you come to Pickwick Lake right here for these little bowling ball largies <laughs> that is hilarious what is that four large mouth that we've caught or yeah. three four wow it's a beautiful little fish though yeah, tell me you still got it maybe yeah, oh my god i had your line or i had oh dude i had your line guys no that's my fault i probably cast it over you well that was cool just add that to the list of me and mikey balls fails together Anytime Mikey fishes with me or any of my compadres, <laughs> you experience all the nonsense that we get ourselves through. Look at this nonsense. Look as at it, that garbage right as there. As we're about to beach on that. As we're about to beach, about the freaking Titanic over here. And he just hung the tree. Get him, Goose. I'm working, so. Yeah, I feel it. Yeah, what do you need from me, man? Uh, just a uh, fishing line, fish, fish, fish. And a what? Fish, yeah. uh, we don't got any fish. No so, fish. <laughs> Fishing a tournament then? No, no man. We're YouTubers, brother. We don't keep a fish. Keep anything. So you just moved to Alabama. They sold you a non-residence when you live in Alabama. Well, I, I live in Alabama. My driver's license is still Florida, so I still pay out of state. Yeah, it sucks too. <laughs> it's expensive. 90 days after you transfer your your driver's license to uh -huh. the state, you can get a residence. Okay, cool. Thank you, sir. I can, you can check them. Yeah, no, yeah. He's being a guard dog. Mikey's training him to not like the game wardens. <laughs> Mikey, I have never been checked by a game warden, ever. Really? Ever. It's the first time I've ever been out fishing and have somebody ask for my fishing license. But by God, I had it. Oh! It's a giant large It is. Watch out, buddy. Let's see if we can get this sucker. Mikey's hooked up with a big old large mouth hey, over here. This bank. Yeah. Oh, my. Ooh, God, that's oh, a good one, dude. Oh, my gosh. Guys, Game Warden just rolled up on us, right, <laughs> to check check fishing licenses. I mean, of course, we had them because we're both good, upstanding citizens, but Mikey just caught a monster largemouth. <laughs> of course, we're trying to catch smallmouth, but you know what? I don't think we're going to be picky, but he just caught a monster, so make sure you go to his channel, check out his video, and you can see that fish. But it's time for me to get in the front time for me to catch one but this this one has to be a small mouth we've got to run across a big small mouth today as much as we have struggled all right well it would appear that it would be my turn fish. Oh, that's dude. a fish oh, dude. come on be a smallie be a smallie it is, it is, it's, it's a smallie it it's a smallie oh my god come on stay on there buddy is it is it no i'm not sure are you sure positive Oh no. No, it's not, is it? No, it's a freaking largey. It's a nice one. <laughs> Are you joking no, me, man? Dude, I thought it was dark. I like... thought it was a smolly too. Oh, oh, it came right out too. Look at that. Oh my god, it came right out, bro. <laughs> nice, man. Okay, that's a stout look. Get your lick, get your lick. All right. Dude, that's a stout fish, man. That's a like that's a solid little fish right there. He took you for a run. He did. God, we both thought though, I think it was the way he was shaped and he looked dark. We got the dark portion. He looked oh, like little football. Oh, he's pooping on us. Oh god, no, no, no. Oh god. He's pooping on us. You want to poop? You want to poop? <laughs> All right, buddy. Thank you so much, although it's not what we're looking for beautiful fish stout fish mikey i mean if we were fishing for largies we'd be feeling pretty good about ourselves right now but we're not but we're not <laughs> god that came right out came out of his mouth as you were lipping and that was crazy oh my goodness all right mr nico well thank you for uh scoring me a fish although that's not what we were looking for 
Dang it. Get back out there and do your job. We just we just like to pull practical jokes on ourselves, that's all. Hey guys, you wanna go you wanna go catch some smallies? Yeah, let's go to Pickwick, catch some smallies. Boom, nothing but largemouth. And good ones too. Oh, there's there's another one. There's another one right there. Come on, be a smallie. That's a lot smaller of a fish. Nope. Oh boy. Just call me the largemouth master. Look at <laughs> goose. Alright. Look at this, this is the smallest one of the day. Look at that lunker right there. This is a wall hanger. Woo! Oh, boys. Although I think we're approaching the right area. Largies. Uh, they're nice little bass too, that's the, that's the problem. <laughs> oh, I believe it, because I'm right here with you. Oh, boy. We're on them. Oh, oh, it's oh, it's a big smallie, yes. It's a big Watch out, buddy. Watch out, goose. Oh my God, finally. Oh, go straight. oh God, don't let him go. Oh God, where is he? Okay. That joker's fighting. Dude, they're God, so mean. please don't break off. Oh, <laughs> Come on. Dude, this thing, it just keeps going down and down and down. I can't even believe it. This is so much different than a largemouth fight. Dude, it's crazy. So Jeez. There you go. Ah, yeah, look at that freaking football, <laughs> dude. Holy smokes. Ooh, what a freaking football. Dude, your game on. Yes. Game dude, we're getting guy. on them. Oh, 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 <laughs> nice. We got to catch loads of Yes, first. now it's my turn. Jeez. Drop the poles, boys. We're on them. 25 yard cast. Right there. Ooh, guys, we might be on the smallmouth hunt. Finally, we have put in some freaking time today guys. Let me tell you and we have weeded through Largemouth after largemouth even though a couple of those largemouth were really nice. That was not our goal today Mikey just caught himself probably a three pound or four pounder smallmouth really nice smallmouth, but I've got to catch one guys I, I simply have to Let's See if we can bounce one of these small crankbaits around on These rocks see what that do See what it do at least I can chuck it a freaking mile. Got it? Yep, you got one. What you got? What you got? What you got? Oh, it's a big small. God dang it. It's oh, come on. Okay. Oh. They come off? Dude, no. Dude, I freaking didn't think. I thought I had a rock. Dude. Oh, my God. Big small. Dude, I need a Ned rig, dude. I need a Ned rig ASAP. Coincidentally, this is going to be my first time ever using a Ned rig. So if this is going to be the thing that ends up catching me, my first ever smallie and a good size one at that. I am all for it. Mikey's just kind of letting this thing fall, shaking it, and that's how he's working it. I can do anything if it's gonna catch a fish. I'll get naked and dance around a little bit if that's what it's gonna take. There he is. Yep. Got him. Come on, be something. I don't know. Don't be a white bass. What? Freaking rock rock bass? Are you joking me? Dude, this can't stop. stop it. I mean, this can't even be real life. His mouth is so freaking small I can't even grab him. Really? Is this what we've come to, Mikey? It came right out. Is this is this what we're is this what we're doing here? He cannot catch a small mouth. I cannot catch a small mouth. Bass. How many different bass have we caught today though? This is the fifth fifth species of bass. Dude. Look how fat that freaking thing is, though. On another note, I've been eating it. Well, that's freaking... eating your big bait. Right, I mean, is this is this real life? Get back in there. Get is this real life? Wow, guys! First Ned rig fish of my life, though. Is a rock, rock bass. bass. Wow, chief. In a freaking smally hey, lake. You got nowhere to go, but. <laughs> <laughs> guys, this is this cannot even be real. We have caught smallmouth, largemouth, rock bass, white bass. Is that it? Yeah, we just need to catch a spot. You need to catch a small. Area. That's incredible. That is incredible. Welcome to Alabama. Buddy. Welcome to Alabama. Although I already live here, but apparently I can't catch a freaking smallmouth to save my life. Oh my God! Jeez! What? Oh my God! I don't know. Oh my God! Dude, what in the world? I saw it and it looked brown. Dude. I don't know what it was. It, it's <laughs> like it. I, 
Did you see that? That's not a junk fish. Dude, right, it's, it it's like I just snagged it. Like it didn't eat it. I just, I saw the side of it. It might have been a gar. Like I think I just snagged something. I don't even know, dude. I'm, I'm like at a loss for words. There you go, guys. No more mystery. Did not catch a smallmouth today. Had uh, several, <laughs> several opportunities. This guy over here laughing because he stuck a couple. Well, he stuck one nice one, then he missed uh, another one. Came off that was probably bigger than that yeah, first that one. Did so a big one, dude. Uh, I mean, I did everything I feel like I could have done. We came out here with the mindset of like finesse. From from the first moment yeah. we got out here, it was Nico rig, Ned rig, light Texas rig, small worms, small hooks. You know, just to target those smallmouth, but we had to weed through like what six or seven largemouth. Yeah, a bunch and a big, a, a, one a big largemouth. Remember, guys, go check out his channel if you want to see that fish. But I mean, we just—it was—it was a good fishing day. You hate to say days like days like this are bad because yeah. we caught some fish. We had a nice little bag of largemouth. We wouldn't have won any term, but we had a nice little bag though, and uh, we just couldn't. We couldn't dial in on the smallmouth until much later in the evening, which is what it is right now. And we just ran out of daylight. You know, if we had another hour or two, we could probably pick off a couple more smallies in this same little area. But you know what? That's fishing, guys. You know, uh, definitely going to try again. Me and him are actually going to fish another lake tomorrow. I don't know if it's going to be a smallmouth lake or not, but definitely stay tuned. Say hi to Bog. Yeah, say hi to Bog. You guys saw him a little bit earlier when we were making our first run, but uh, he's been our fish companion. He has successfully licked every single bass that's come in this boat, <laughs> including the rock bass. I forgot yeah, about the rock bass. He tried I, to eat that one. He dude. tried to eat that one. That would have been a nice little fish sandwich for old Bog. But anyways, <laughs> guys, make sure you smash the thumbs up button if you like these collaborations. You know, I love fishing with Mikey Balls. This is my second time fishing with him. Tomorrow will be my third time. Might pull some big bass in tomorrow. I don't know if we're going to go to Lake Gunnersville or Lake Wilson, but there's a lot of good lakes in North Alabama for largemouth and smallmouth. So stay tuned for that. Make sure you subscribe, guys, with the bell notification turned on. That's the key part. That way you don't miss an upload. Guys, we're getting out of here. On to the next fishing adventure. Fist bump. We're out.